And now, news you choose from viewer Ilya. He loves all things sports and can't wait for teams to get back to playing. So this headline was bittersweet. Sports are returning. Virus cases are rising. How many is too many? Here's what we know right now. NBA teams have arrived at Disney World and are looking to restart their season later in July. Games and practices will be held at the ESPN Wide World of Sports facility on the theme park grounds. The campus is large enough to allow two games at once, but no fans in the stands. Players and staff are following a 113-page guidebook on health and safety regulations and hope to keep the campus virus-free. <laughs> Major League Baseball released a TV schedule for its 60-game season. Opening night could be Thursday, July 23rd with a pair of night games. New York Yankees at Washington Nationals and the San Francisco Giants at Los Angeles Dodgers. Players have already been reporting for spring training, but several teams have canceled the workouts because of delays with results of coronavirus testing. The league has an ambitious plan and wants to have games played at 30 ballparks with travel in between. Will it be a hit? The NHL has reached a tentative deal to resume its hockey season. Games will start on, drumroll please, August 1st. If things go according to plan, teams will start training camps mid-July. Then they'll travel to two hub cities and get back on the ice. The two hub cities are Toronto and Edmonton. Could we be awarding the Stanley Cup in early October? Hockey fans hope so.